Democracy 2013 coverage. If you are heading out to vote this morning in Kansas City, there will be a new way to check in at your polling place. Yes, this morning the Kansas City Election Board of Elections will have new electronic poll rosters that are expected to reduce your wait time. Jenna Hanchard is live in Brookside at a local polling place with more on this. Jenna? Good morning, Jajau. Good morning, Lance. So here's what it looks like. This is a tablet. This is not the exact tablet that they will be using in here this morning, but it looks very similar. And this is how um, judges will be able to look up voter information. So they'll be able to scan your driver's license or scan your voter ID card and look up your information that way. So uh, election officials told me that Kansas City really is one of the last cities in Missouri to have this system in the state of Missouri to introduce Reduce the electronic poll rosters. More than 30 Missouri election authorities are already using them. The Kansas City Election Board ordered 150 e poll books from St. Louis. So officials told me there will be at least one tablet in every voting place. The larger polling locations will have two. The new system is expected to provide an overall more efficient voting process. These are records are quicker. Uh, you don't have to have lines instead of having an A through M and an L through Z line or whatever. You actually just have any line that is the shortest. So a voter can come in, they, uh, they present a, any ID, any form of identification they'd like to uh, give us, and then we'll look them up and get them processed in about half to a third of the time. So what happens when one of these stops working? We always know that electronics can stop working at any point in time. So they do have those books available, those paper books that you do have to look up. They have those as a backup if these start working. We'll have much more about these tablet systems and how you'll be able to use them when you head to your polling place coming up in the next hour. Reporting live here in Brookside, Jenna Hanchard, 41 Action News.